I've got the OnePlus 7 Pro right here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to boot the OnePlus 7 as well as the OnePlus 7 Pro into and out of fast boot mode. So this whole process is similar to how to boot into recovery mode, which I showed you how to do yesterday. So we're going to start off by bringing up the power menu and turning off the device. Now fast boot mode is also known as bootloader mode. So if you're told to boot into bootloader mode, this is the same tutorial that you will be following as the terms are interchangeable. So once you have the device completely powered off, we're going to be pressing and holding the power button as well as the volume up and volume down buttons at the same time. So we're going to be holding all three buttons down once the device has completely shut down. So once we hold these three buttons down, we're going to continue holding these three buttons down. And you can see that that's going to boot us into a fast boot mode splash screen for OnePlus. As soon as you see that splash screen, let go of all three buttons. Now, as you just saw, sometimes you don't let go of all three buttons at the same time. And what happens is it actually triggers the first option. So whenever you try to let go of all three buttons, you're actually pressing the power button, or at least the phone thinks that you're pressing the power button, and it's selecting the start option which is going to reboot the phone and take you into Android. So if you notice that when you let go of all three buttons, that the phone is just rebooting, try it again. It can take a few times to get the timing just right. But again, once you see that fast boot mode splash screen, you can let go of the, all three buttons and you're going to be taken to this menu. Now, unlike OnePlus's recovery mode, the fast boot mode is not touch activated. You cannot control or navigate this menu through the touch. So like I mentioned before, we're going to have to revert to using the hardware buttons to navigating this menu. So we have this top option for start, and that's what it's going to be set to by default. When we press the volume down button, we're going to be scrolling through the menu options up here at the top. So this will restart us into bootloader, AKA fast boot mode. We press the volume down button again. We're going to see this change to recovery mode, which if selected will boot us over into recovery mode. And then we have the power off option. So you can see all the options that we have here available for us in fast boot mode that we can navigate through using the volume up and volume down buttons. And then once you pick an option that you want to select, just to show you in this test, I'm going to select restart bootloader, which is going to restart us into fast boot mode again. You just need to press the power button to select the option that is currently displayed at the top of the screen. So if start was displayed and we press the power button, then it would start us into Android. If power off was selected and highlighted, then when we press the power button, it will shut the device down. So now you know how to boot both the OnePlus 7 and the OnePlus 7 Pro into fast boot mode. And like I told you before, if we have the start option highlighted and we press the power button, it's going to restart our OnePlus smartphone and boot us back into Android. So it's possible, although very unlikely, but possible that you accidentally boot into fast boot mode on your device. So if that happens to you, then again, just make sure that you have the start option highlighted, press the power button, and you should boot back up into Android. That is, unless you have messed up your Android install, and maybe you are boot looping into fast boot mode. If that's the case, then you're gonna to need to follow an unbrick tutorial. 
And there's also other reasons for us to boot into fast boot mode on the OnePlus 7 and the OnePlus 7 Pro. And I'll be getting into that in future tutorials.